This is Kurt Heisinger, accounting professor at Sierra College and author of Managerial Accounting. This video discusses the importance of an enterprise resource planning system and how companies utilize these systems for decision-making purposes. The first thing I want to talk about is related to the design of these enterprise resource planning systems. These systems share information across functional areas and geographical areas. For example, with functional areas, we're talking about areas within the company like marketing. Marketing, for example, may want to get cost information related to a marketing ad campaign that they've done somewhere in South America. Uh, and that would be the geographical part of it, but the functional part would be the marketing element. Maybe we have human resources looking for cost information uh, for payroll within certain areas of the company. So again, that's the functional piece. And if we want to do that by region, for example, example in Europe, that would be the geographical part of it. So the enterprise resource planning system would provide, to the second bullet point here, real-time data so that users, the examples I just gave you, can use that information for decision-making purposes. As another example, a real-life example, uh, Howard Schultz, who is the CEO of Starbucks, has stated in his, his recent book called Onward that he reviews comparative financial data for their individual stores on a daily basis. And Starbucks is all across the world, so for him to be able to do that, they have to have a somewhat robust enterprise resource planning system to make that happen. Now, uh, data within in these ERP systems can be organized in many different formats. It's not uncommon, for example, to be able to download information from an ERP system into an Excel format, and then that information can be formatted in, in a number of different ways to help managers, again, make decisions. ERP systems can be rather expensive. It really does depend on the size of the company and the needs of the company. But, but for the larger companies out there, it's not uncommon for these systems to cost tens of millions of dollars on an annual basis. As I mentioned earlier, the data can be downloaded to uh, spreadsheet software like Excel, and that really does help particularly managerial accountants take that information and format it in a way that's useful for managers within the company and across different geographical regions.